Hello everyone, I'm back. Today we're diving into something darker, wilder, and way more intense than anything we've covered before. You've probably heard of ChatGPT, the friendly AI that writes essays, codes apps, and answers your wildest questions. But what if I told you there's a version out there that looks like ChatGPT but acts like its evil twin? Yes, it's an AI tool which is designed not to help but to hack. It's like turning an average criminal into high-tech villains with supercharged cyber attackers. A quick question, have you heard of tools like Fraud GPT or Worm GPT? Or maybe even tried exploring them? For research, of course. Drop a comment below if you have or if you know of something that's even crazier. I just might feature your take in the next video. Stay with me because in this video we are exposing the underworld of malicious AI like Fraud GPT and Worm GPT and revealing how they're changing the game in cybersecurity for the worse. And hey, if you're into AI tech or just want to stay safe online, make sure you hit that like, subscribe and ring that bell so you never miss another wild update from the front lines of AI warfare. What is Fraud GPT? Fraud GPT first hit the radar in mid-2023, discovered by cybersecurity researchers who were monitoring shady activities on Telegram. It's being sold on dark web marketplaces like Empire, Torres, Alphabay, and Versus for about 200 bucks a month or $1,700 a year. And this thing isn't just some amateur tool, it's marketed as an AI without limits, rules, or boundaries. Basically, it's ChatGPT's evil twin, trained to do everything your IT department dreads. With just a few prompts, cyber criminals can use it to craft hyper-personalized phishing emails, build malware and undetectable viruses, create fake login pages to steal credentials, even write scam letters or full-on hacking guides, and yes, it updates every couple of weeks with new models, making it a constantly evolving threat. How does Fraud GPT work? Researchers at NetEnrich, a cybersecurity company in Texas, got their hands on Fraud GPT to see what it could do. John Bambanek, their lead threat hunter, called it one of the first real signs that threat actors are baking generative AI into their toolkits. Its interface looks just like ChatGPT with chatbox, history sidebar, and a familiar UI. But instead of asking for help with homework, users are typing things like write a phishing email to trick a manager into wiring company funds. And boom, it generates a flawless, convincing email in seconds. Fraud GPT can also write malicious scripts, generate phishing landing pages, suggest vulnerable websites, and provide step-by-step -step attack strategies. What makes it so scary? It's likely trained on malware datasets, making it really good at writing believable, dangerous content. How is Fraud GPT different from ChatGPT? The biggest difference, guardrails. ChatGPT is designed to reject harmful or unethical requests. But Fraud GPT, it welcomes them. It understands criminal intent and generates content so convincing it's almost impossible to tell it apart from legitimate communication. Think of ChatGPT as your responsible friend who reminds you not to do anything illegal. But Fraud GPT, that's the same friend, but now they're helping you run a scam without blinking. Fraud GPT isn't the only malicious AI out there. Meet Worm GPT, another tool for making waves in the cybercrime world. It was built using the GPTJ language model and first popped up in 2021. It offers features like unlimited characters, memory retention, and code formatting support. Worm GPT was reportedly trained on malware heavy datasets, though the exact sources are a mystery. Just like Fraud GPT, it has no ethical boundaries. Even rookie hackers can use it to launch sophisticated business email compromise attacks. AI lowers the barrier to entry, and now even less skilled actors can sound alarmingly professional. Now here's the twist. Artificial intelligence isn't just being used by hackers. Cybersecurity teams are fighting back using AI to detect threats, flag unusual patterns, and stop attacks before they succeed. It's a high-stakes race, offense versus defense. And AI is playing both sides. But it's not just criminals or IT pros at risk. Employees are using tools like ChatGPT at work, and they could accidentally leak sensitive info without realizing it. Big companies like Apple and Samsung have already restricted internal use of ChatGPT, and here's why. A March 2023 bug leaked user payment data from ChatGPT. Future AI models are trained on user inputs unless you opt out. One study found ChatGPT gave wrong answers 52% of the time on programming tasks. If we treat AI-generated info as gospel or paste confidential data into it, we open the door to security risks we may not see coming. So, how to stay safe in an AI-powered threat landscape? 
John Bumbenek said it best. Fundamentally, this doesn't change the dynamics of what a phishing campaign is, nor the context in which it operates. As long as you aren't dealing with phishing from a compromised account, reputational systems can still detect phishing from inauthentic senders, like typo squatted domains, invoices from free web email accounts, etc. He also emphasizes that implementing a defense in-depth strategy with all the security telemetry available for fast analytics can also help organizations identify a phishing attack before attackers compromise a victim and move on to the next phase of an attack. Bambanek also added, defenders don't need to detect every single thing an attacker does in a threat chain. They just have to detect something before the final stages of an attack, that is, ransomware or data exfiltration. So having a strong security data analytics program is essential. So what can you do to protect yourself and your business? Here's your action plan. Stay alert. Always double check emails, especially unexpected ones asking for personal info. Upgrade security tools. Use AI-powered solutions that flag threats early. Train your team. Educate employees on how AI-generated scams work. Limit sensitive input. Don't paste confidential data into AI tools unless you're sure it's safe. Fight AI with AI. Invest in defensive systems that analyze patterns and detect anomalies. Cybercrime is getting smarter, but so can we. Broad GPT is a chilling example of how AI innovation can be flipped on its head. But it also reminds us of something crucial. Awareness is power. As malicious tools evolve, so must our defenses. And that starts with education, vigilance, and using AI the right way. Fraud GPT might be ChatGPT's evil twin, but staying informed is our best defense. And before we wrap up, here's a heads up. If you thought this was wild, wait till you see what we will uncover in our next video. We're checking out Claude, the AI from Anthropic that just learned to talk. And it's not just talking, it's having real-time thoughtful conversations. You don't want to miss that one. If this video opened your eyes, hit like, share it with a friend, and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss what's coming next. Stay curious, stay cautious, and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.